Hello and welcome back to CADMEC, the channel where mechanical engineering comes alive through visuals, logic, and real-world applications. I'm Yogesh Sahu, and today we're diving deep into a very essential topic, types of pumps and their uses in mechanical engineering. Whether you're a beginner, a student, or even an industry professional, this video will give you a strong foundation. So let's get started. First, what exactly is a pump? A pump is a mechanical device used to move fluids, like water, oil, chemicals, from one place to another, often by increasing the pressure. They are widely used in power plants, water treatment systems, oil refineries, HVAC systems, and manufacturing processes. Pumps can be broadly classified into two main categories, positive displacement pumps and dynamic or kinetic pumps. Let's break these down one by one. These pumps move a fixed volume of fluid with each cycle. They are ideal for high pressure and low flow applications. They're further classified into 1. Reciprocating pumps. Use pistons or plungers. Motion is back and forth. Example, piston pumps, diaphragm pumps, used in high pressure cleaning systems, hydraulic systems, fuel injection. 2. Rotary pumps. Use gears, screws or vanes to move fluid. Example, gear pump, screw pump, vein pump, used in lubrication systems, oil processing, food and chemical industries. Positive displacement pumps are very efficient for viscous fluids like oil or syrup and when precision is required. Dynamic pumps add energy to the fluid by velocity and then convert it to pressure. They're best for high flow, low viscosity applications. 1. Centrifugal pumps, most common type, uses impeller to increase velocity of fluid, used in water supply, irrigation, fire protection systems, HVAC. 2. Axial flow pumps. Fluid moves parallel to the shaft. High flow rate, low head, used in flood control, cooling water circulation. 3. Mixed flow pumps. Combination of centrifugal and axial types. Used in drainage systems, agriculture. Dynamic pumps are simple in construction and cost effective, especially where large volumes of fluid need to be moved. There are also some special purpose pumps used in specific industries. Peristaltic pumps, used in medical and chemical dosing applications. Jet pumps, use a jet of fluid to create suction, commonly used in wells. Submersible pumps, operate while submerged in the fluid, ideal for drainage and bore wells. Choosing the right pump depends on several factors. Type of fluid, clean, dirty, viscous, required flow rate and head, pressure needed, operating environment, temperature, submersion, explosion proof. Example, for a water treatment plant, centrifugal pumps are typically used for pumping thick slurry. A positive displacement pump like a diaphragm or screw pump is preferred. So let's quickly recap. Positive displacement pumps, accurate, high pressure, low flow, dynamic pumps, high flow, low pressure, each type has its role in various industries like oil and gas, power, HVAC, agriculture, and water treatment. Knowing these fundamentals will help you in design, selection, and even maintenance of pump systems in real projects. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to CADMA. Comment below if you want a dedicated video on pump selection or performance curves. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.